All right, so welcome to Morning for Walrus. I'm your host, Stephen Weathers, and this is a game that someone, well, I say someone, uh, one of the developers, there's two guys, I forget their names, one is named Ed, and I believe Ed was the one who contacted me on YouTube asking if I'd like to, we'll give this game a shot, and maybe put up a video. There's been no bribing or anything, the game isn't out until, uh, I think, last quarter of this year, I think, so fall slash winter, if you're in the US, unless you're in Australia, then spring. Or no, summer. Summer. Um, so the game is Manaspark. It's... Am I right-handed or left-handed? Uh, guys, you gotta help me on this one. I believe I'm right-handed. Um... Wait, what? But... <laughs> um... Okay. What was the letters? Okay, well, whatever. I'm just going to use the, the classic JKLI uh, key formatting, as we've always used in our games. All right, so... Okay, I have an arrow. I can shoot it with either the left or right click. A scroll wheel does nothing. There's a goblin, who is now dead, I think. Ah. All right, murdering a dog. Ooh, headshot. All right. Killed a couple goblins. Lost a little bit of health. Killed a dog. Good stuff. You? Ooh, cool. Ah. I would really enjoy some kind of reload power-up. That would be good. I'd be very... Okay okay with that. I want to say it's a booby trap, but I don't know. So from my understanding, this is a roguelike in the sense that it randomly generated. I'm assuming that was a big door. What does it do? Yep. Okay. It's a trap. <coughs> Called it. Uh, where you play a human in a world of, as far as I can tell so far, it's still like an alpha or something, or beta or something. Um... Oh, okay, I did open. Oh, that almost got me, potentially, if that's the thing that this does. Next floor. Um. What the hell was I saying? Oh, uh, roguelike, you're a human, you're just weaker. Oh, shit. You are weaker than everyone else. That is one of the key features of the game, is that all of the baddies are stronger than you. You are the minority in this world. Thought those were sheep. Those are not sheep. Eh. Damn it. Ah, big strong guy, big strong guy. Eh. Okay, almost dead. Oh, that makes it awkward. So I'm right handed using the left handed controls because it didn't quite register that I was um, trying to click right handed. So space is dash means I have to use my pinky to dash, which is incredibly awkward. Eh, don't hit me, I'm almost dead. I saw an older playthrough of the game and some guy got a health. I would love to have a health. <laughs> I would really enjoy a health. Come on. <laughs> there we go. I got hot sauce my bag, swag. I've been listening to Formation a lot, because it's a really good song. <laughs> what do you got? What do you got? I don't know. Ooh. Boop. Oh, Chain Reaction. I like that. That's cool. You are dead. So dead. Alright, so there's, I'm guessing, the end of level switch. Yeah, I don't like that. Ah, he's poisoned. Come on. There we go. I'm assuming those are magic guys who cast magic if they... Ooh, food, 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 food. Yes, that was pretty good. That's a fair amount of health for a, uh, for a roguelike. I really wish I could use the... Uh, damn, that's so awkward. That kind of hurts my wrist. Using your pinky to dodge by hitting the space bars... Very unfortunate. And, eh, eh, er, okay, that's open. 
I, I missed something, didn't I? There was another another walk. And now map looks pretty full. All right, whatever. Into the dark unknown I go. Oh, uh hum. I'm really enjoying this game so far. It's um. I don't feel like I'm going to constantly be dying a super lot. Okay, so you come into the first room, you're locked into the stairwell, which means that this is probably a boss. Let's see what you got. Yeah. Er, no, just, uh, just that's where they did, er, yep, total boss room. Wonder if it's a beholder. Oh, <laughs> it's just a library. Well, that's that's cool too. Ah, this is the boss room. Ah, called it. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Poison arrows. Oh crap! <laughs> All right, that was startling. If the boss, oh crap! I've been turned to stone. Uh, this All right. That wasn't bad for a first run, right? <laughs> I really wish I could change my, uh, change my controls. Right-handed. Yeah, I can't seem to choose the right option. But left works fine. Okay. Well, okay, whatever. Oh. Tricky. I see. Okay. Turns out that um, both right-handed and left-handed uh, keyboard keys are active just in general. <laughs> so you don't have to necessarily hit a button yet. So from what I heard, from what I was reading about this game, is that um, the AI is um, what's the word? Herd-based. So the bad guys will team up and murder you when they run into fellow bad guys. So that's cool. Okay, that's much better. Okay, there's a cooldown on the roll. That's for the best. I want this to get too wacky. Ooh, piercing arrow from sharp feather? Okay. So I think with the, the right-handed, left-handed option in the menu, it's mostly changing the, um, what key to push in-game screen so like it'll tell you to hit the u key or it'll tell you to hit the e key for activating or opening stuff but whatever this reminds me a lot of um yeah oh sweet oh ah of a uh, dungeon soul which i should probably play more of because i think they've had a couple updates since the last time i played the game it's like dungeon soul but you might actually win <laughs> Chicken. Should I save it? Eh, who cares? Brave little bugger. <laughs> little did he know this would be his end. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, was that four hits? Give or take. There's more sheep. More murder sheep. Like murder sheep. Yep, mage guys. Yeah. Because when you, after you shoot your arrow, there's kind of a couple seconds where you can't move. Ooh, good. Nice. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna hang out over here for a second. Okay. <laughs> the, the sheep have chain reactioned enough. Oh, push corpses. That's weird. I can cancel out fireballs? That's weird. I don't know why I'm trying to kill everyone other than for swag, because, like, there isn't a kill counter. I don't get experience. What the hell's that? I don't know. Maybe it's just debris. Huh. Um, you don't level up, you don't get experience, you just get occasional items from stuff, so I guess that's the only real reason to 
attack stuff. Which is fine. Whatever. I could just power through it and not kill things, but then, oh, no, yep, because then there's the boss, and that would end badly, of course. I'm a fool. I'm a course. I'm a fool. Wow. How did I miss? Seriously, though, how did I miss that? <laughs> uh, I guess I'll check out what the bottom of this room is. I like the map. It's clear. It's pretty, pretty simple. Not too flashy. Doesn't need to be. Um, yeah, so this game's gonna end up on Steam probably this fall, I think. It's kind of what it was sounding like. I didn't have a, I don't have like an actual date to give you or anything. It just said last quarter of uh, 2016, blah, blah, blah. Is it the library again? I will say I'm gonna miss the poison arrows. The poison arrow is great. <laughs> I got hot sauce in my bag, swag. All right. <laughs> Jesus. God, that's terrifying. Ugh. No Magusta. Oh, it, okay. It kind of homes. Noted. Or no, it just kind of moves around. No laser, no laser, no. No, that's bueno, Mr. Laser. Okay. A, that's a slow death, but okay, I can dig it. Can I hide? Is he gonna explode? Okay, no, I guess not. I don't get anything for that, really. <laughs> I don't know, I, I guess I've kind of got the Zelda mindset where the boss should explode into a box of items or something. <laughs> hey, I win! <laughs> Beat the demo, cool. So, yeah, this is by Behemoth. Not Behemoth, but Behemoth. You can find him at com. You can find Oliver. I believe it's Oliver. Or, no, it's something with a D. It's D. Oliveira. You can find the the two guys there. I believe Return 1 is the art director guy, and then the first name, the D. Oliveira, 87, is the um lead coder, I guess. Um, This was a lot of fun. I really like this game. I'm going to keep my eyes on this and probably put out a couple more things, too. What is that sound? <laughs> My mom's making smoothies. Cool. I like smoothies. Um, yeah, check them out. You can find them on Twitter. You can find them on the website. Uh, I'll leave links down in the who's a what's it's in the move. My camera. This is weird in the who's a what's it down below. Um, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, leave a comment. If you have anything to say, if you didn't like the video, leave a like, leave a comment if you have anything to say, or you can dislike it. That's cool, too. But really, leave a comment. That's the important part. If you want to see more of this or some of the other things that uh, we put out on the channel, just leave a subscribe. You'll get notified You'll get notified of when we uh, upload stuff, because that's how YouTube works, for the most part. Um, I've been your host, Stephen Weathers. This has been Manaspark. That's the one. Um, later days. I got hot sauce in my bag, swag.